JWL for Loud and Goff. We want to talk about one of our most unique products, and that's embroidered head covers, both in putter covers, large ones for your mallets, and the small ones. But our most popular is the head cover for the driver. And of course, we make this in a three and a five wood, a seven wood, nine wood. And what's unique about this head cover is we've left a little extra cloth at the bottom and a little extra cloth at the top, and why? So it allows you to put the head cover on easily and take it off easily. So very easily take it off very easily put on and that allows the client to always keep his head cover on if it's socked out a lot of you'll see people put it in the back cage of the cart and they'll never use it their golf clubs get dinged up let's take a look at some of the embroidery work we've done in the past on a national scale we've done castor oil we've done Hilton Garden Inn of course this is my alma mater that's JU Dolphins so we can do collegiate one uh, then we got the hot chocolate we have one of the golf courses up in Georgia called the Golden Isles and of course, the Caterpillar dealership, Randy Ringhaver, here in North Florida. The last thing I want to talk about in the head cover is the quantity. We, we ask for 100 minimum. There's no a limit on the stitch count. Uh, we can go with different colors. This is the two-tone, and you can see the single tone over here. And uh, also, there's no charge for your embroidery as far as your art setup work. Last thing is for an older crowd, they love it because when you throw it on the ground, you can actually pick it up with your head, with your golf club, without bending over. And that's very important for the older clientele. It comes in a 500cc, so it can be very adaptable to your 450cc and up golf clubs. Again, it's a great golf club cover. It lasts a minimum of three years, and we can do all the embroidery. We can even put uh, any two-dimensional artwork on there from a teddy bear to a rabbit, whatever. Give us a call. It's a great product. Jim Loudenslager here for Loudon Goth tour tips on grips. We'd like to talk about what we do for some of the local professionals in the area. We've designed a small grip display that goes on the desk in the pro shop and it goes over all the lasering we do. Take a look at this. This is Santosha, the famous resort out of Costa Rica. Here's your gators, Tim Tebow. And of course, here we go with the military, Navy captain. And of course, Here's a nice golf course on the west side, very strong course there called Panther Creek. So we can just about do anything in lasering. So come on in, get a personalized grip uh, with your business name on it or uh, just uh, where, you where you play out of with your name. It does away with theft and loss on your golf clubs. The next thing the display does is go over our wedges. We have right and left-handed mill wedges. We also carry the Snake Eyes, the Swing Science, and the Black Melanite Alphas. These are all hand fitted to you and they should be fitted to your level of play and matched into your set of irons. Very important in that fitting aspect. The next thing I like to talk about is another grip company. And by the way, who does all this lasering for us is Avon Grips based out of Texas. They also do Harley Davidson Grips, NHL hit Grips, a great golf company. The next one that we highly recommend is Lampkin. That's Bobby and Tom Lampkin. This is the new invisible cord. You cannot even see the cord these days. It's very soft on your hands. So cord has now been made soft. This is their famous Pro Performance Velvet with the different cut on the side. And of course their double softy wrap white stripe. Great grips there. We also handle Golf Pride and Win. We don't think they're quite as good as the Avon and Lampkin grip companies. The last thing I like to talk about in grip is rib versus round. The ribbing Put your hands on the club for consistent shot making. Get that same trajectory off the tee down the fairway and put your rounds on your wedges so you can open them up, finesse them in there, and check them up with your new milled wedges. So remember, gripping and wedges, very important to get fitted to you. I promise you, if you get the right grip, you'll play better.